it's a massive weight off your shoulders there, the first league win of the season, you must be delighted. Yeah, it's actually it's been a good week, if you break it down. Uh, Yeovil gets his first point away from home against the Championship team from last season. Uh, outstanding performance against Reading, OK, the result didn't go our way, but and, and three points today, so it's, it's been a good week for the club. Yeah, uh, what do we your assessment on the performance then today? I thought we were outstanding at, at, at times and, and looked like we were very, very comfortable at uh, 2-0. Uh, looked the team likely to get the next goal and, and go on and win by 4-5 or five if, if, if possible. But uh, again, that, that third goal is the key goal. Uh, it's obviously a very disappointing goal from, from our point of view. But what I'd say regarding that is, you know, Niles held his hand up, he's got to go and head the ball. But what was really pleasing from that is Niles' development. Uh, if that probably happens the last time in League One, his game maybe crumbles a little bit. Um, shows how he's, how he's moved on uh, mentally, how, how much stronger he is. And I thought after the mistake, um, he was solid. Um, and that was so pleasing. Yeah, just after like, the, like, the defensive mix-up then, it's good that the players will bounce back in it and don't get too down about that. Yeah, that's right, and the, and it's not cost us. I think that's the key. You know, if it costs us, I probably won't be saying the same thing to you now as I've just <laughs> yeah. said. Um, that that's how football works, and we were edgy after that. And understandably, the crowd get a little bit edgy. Um, we saw the game out. I'm not sure if we were comfortable seeing the game out. There were some edgy moments. Um, we defended the box well. Last ten minutes, I'd like us to, to be a bit higher up the pitch, but sometimes that's dictated to by the opposition. They get all of a sudden. Um, a foothold back in the game, it gives them a massive boost, them coming back at 2-1 because I'm sure they're thinking out there that there's nothing for them today and it just gives everybody a, a boost in, from Walsall and gives us a little knock and uh, they got on the front foot and put us under a little bit of pressure but um, thankfully we, we, we saw the game out. Yeah.